Can you believe my friend here is 3D printed? Now Midlands 3D are holding an open day today to demonstrate the evolution of manufacturing in the world of 3D printing. Congratulations, this is a huge date for your diary. Why are you holding this event? So today we're opening the doors, it's our, our open day and we're bringing people in to show them the facility, show them everything that we've got. We've got myself doing a presentation with a little bit of background about Midlands 3D, how we, we've came to where we are now. Uh, we've got West Surrey Racing here with two racing cars to demonstrate all the parts that we, we do for them. Um, we're showing people around in tours to allow them to open, you know, openly ask questions and see the technology, see the materials. Um, we've got lots of demonstration parts, we've got lots of customer projects as well to show them what's possible and the kind of different applications. Um, and really it's, you know, it's, a, it's a meet and greet as much as anything as well. Um, I love the fact that we open our doors you know, and, I'm, and I'm perfectly happy for people to see exactly what goes on behind, behind the scenes. Paul, I've got to say this is an incredible facility. Um, what is happening in the 3D printing industry at the moment? Um, on the customer side in particular, huge adoption. Uh, we, we're seeing now, I think it's the, the evolution of uh, prototyping into production. You know, we're seeing people that maybe were apprentices becoming decision makers and we're seeing them placing the orders or driving the, the agenda within our customers to, to see growth. Um, and from a supplier side, we're just literally having to respond to that and be ready for the, for the change. You know, and that's why we're investing like we are. We're, we're being ready for scaling up even, even more than we are because the kind of conversations that we're having uh, our, customers, our, our customers and conversations I could have only dreamt about three, three or four years ago. Well, before 3D printing, things were a lot riskier because um, you couldn't rapidly prototype things. And you, I would have to draw something as accurately as possible into CAD and then it would have to go into production and you would have to test it. And if it didn't quite fit, then you'd have to tweak the mold, let's say, which could cost thousands. Now with 3D printing, you can prototype things, double check your own work and make sure that it's right before you press the green button and get it manufactured. So it, it, it's, it's, a brilliant, it's, it's a brilliant extra process, which puts out lots of drama. Really, we use Midlands 3D for rapid prototyping parts very low volumes but today is really looking forward trying to productionize some of our parts into larger volumes and it was just to look at the processes and the materials available to do that. It's nice and easy, it fits what we want um, on our product which at the end of the day is bikes, cycles, race cycles um, and the reason we use Paul and Debs, they're so efficient and I can nicely i squeeze them and say i need this 24 hours it's there it's done never ask just get on and get it done um, and we send them all kinds of weird and wonderful stuff and paul will pick up and say well that's identical no it isn't there's a millimeter of difference there and it's great to, they're great to work with honestly really are so uh this is the unveiling of their new additive manufacturing facility um, they're also showcasing their new or latest investments in the HP equipment with the upgrade of uh, their existing machines to 5600s. Um, they've also added automation to those systems, which has allowed them to run back-to-back 12-hour -back builds for 24 hours production. Uh, and they've also added a vapor fusing system from Dynantion. If you speak to Paul and Deb, I mean, I'd like to think that we played it played a, a, a big role in getting them to where they are now. Um, and that, that's a major thing that basically sets Matsura apart from, from most people in the industry is that we, we don't just sell a, a, a box and walk away. We will basically hold your hand for as long as you need us to to get you to this level where you're a successful business.